I'll see you in the next one. Proper store is supposed to start at the beginning. Ain't so simple with this one. Now here's a kid whose whole world got all twisted, leaving him stranded on a rock in the sky. He gets up, sets off for the bastion, where everyone agreed to go in case of trouble. Ground forms up under his feet as it pointing away. He don't stop to wonder why. Finds his lifelong friend just lying in the road. Well, it's a touching reunion. He sees what's left of the rippling walls. Years of work undone in an instant. In the calamity. That a survivor? No, ma'am. It's a gas fella. Forced out from underground. Kid pops him good. Starts to feel his bruises, though. An old repeater falls out of the sky. Ain't a gift from the gods, but it'll have to do. Gotta hold her still to spin up the chamber. Kid's worked up quite a thirst by now, so that fountain looks real inviting. Sometimes you just need a drink. A school of squirts tunnels up around him. Must have fled here from the mines. He sets foot inside one of Selandia's famous watering holes. Wait, haven't I? Anyway, Rondi's place just brings back memories. Then Kid finds his trusty shield. But just as he's getting a handle on it, the security takes him for a petty thief. Special delivery, gas fellas. Windbags start turning up for last call. More squirts start coming out of the woodwork. A big old fella pops out in front of the kid. sees the way to the bastion out the window. He gets a good look at things on his way down. He lands on top of a breaker's bow, and it ain't broke. Kid spies a good perch for some target practice. He knows he should draw the string all the way back. 